Wow, look at those lovely cheeks and those eyes. I was created to experience all of life's joys. Ingrid, be a dear mm. and go visit your granny and bring her some fresh bread. She'll be so happy to see you. Ah. Uh, fine, give it here. There better be pancakes on the table when I get back. Of course, my dear. And do spend some time with your granny. Have a chat. She's so lonely. Yeah, yeah. I'll stick around and chat. shoes in that dirt.
monster. Wanna play? Play what? <laughs> A funny game. And if you win, you get to go back home. And if I don't? <laughs> Meet Gregor. He's lost. Also, I personally never liked him from the start. Maybe that's why. So who then are you? I don't have a name. I'm Moloch, just like all my brothers. Are there a lot of you? Plenty, but I am the only one who likes to play. So, does this game of yours have any kind of rules? The rules are simple. Act as you see fit. And who decides who wins? Not me, that's for sure. Don't be scared. You'll get the hang of things as you go. It's not like you have a choice anyway. Creepy. You're not a very friendly buncher, are you? And you're no angel yourself, Ingrid. Otherwise, you wouldn't have ended up here. What? You want to go home already? You bet I do. Please help me. You see that waterfall? That's a portal to your world behind it. You can go anytime you like. And that's it? Sounds easy peasy. It couldn't be simpler. Give it a go! <laughs> You're a fool of vile. <laughs> Check it out. The waterfall marked you up. Ow. What are these numbers? Your sins are on the left, and your good deeds are on the right. And what am I meant to do with this? Just be yourself. Hmm? 
Must be another way. Looks like the central gear is missing here.
It looks disgusting, but who knows? Maybe it'll come in handy. itself together. <laughs> Fantastic! They installed the elevator solely for the sake of a continuous feed-in cycle! is clogged with food waste and oozing disgusting sticky slime.
Staying for dinner? Ugh, what dinner? I won't be able to stand the sight of meat for the next week. What's the week without meat compared to an eternity in hell? <laughs> Have you seen my worker be brothers? Yeah, I saw them. Why are their mouths so shut? Did they drone on too much like you? <laughs> You're witty, I like you. Perhaps you'll even get out of here. Thanks. I hope so. Here's a word of advice for you. Don't let anyone around here see you. Especially not Auntie Toothache. This place is full of life. Well, death, to be more precise. And you'll only be a nonsense to the locals, getting in the way and showering them with your questions. That mother's never went easy on kids. If he sees a child, he immediately turns them into stone and puts them in his yard as a decoration. And, you know, plenty of others have started following his lead. Decide to wake the owls, huh? Who? I was just walking by. Yeah, yeah. It's not like there's any other road anyway. Exactly. And you're doing nothing but distracting me. Well, perhaps I wanted to help. If you want to help, then tell me something useful. Or don't say anything. Keep in mind that owls like children, but in their own way. They hang up dream catchers, and children die in their nightmare. What's this? Another part of your dumb game? Be nice to Molex, and they'll be nice to you, huh? In this, as you put it, dumb game, you can wash away your sins, but only if you succeed. I behaved terribly and never appreciated how you cared for me. Wow, already repenting, are we? That's good, but words mean nothing if you don't back them up with actions. Quit just sobbing. Maybe you'll get back. I heard one boy managed to escape. to get around the defenses. My cousin managed somehow, although I haven't seen him since. The owls don't let outsiders in, 
and their tree is an impregnable fortress. But who'd even think of meddling with those lunatics? It's a dead end. Hmm, you're right. You can't get the orb in here.
right mind would climb up into an owl's claws? Who in the right mind? Each other. You've already forgotten? We play together. Ah, that must be Cousin Amusing himself. <laughs> That's lacquer. I see. So, what are you doing here? He lost you back there. I'm looking for treasure. And how's that working out? I found something. Now all that's left is to find the exit. <laughs> I don't suppose you know where it is? I was meaning to ask you the same thing. Um, not me done with a feather. Mm, those holes are set for. They cage you up in the tree and you roam around hungry, sleep deprived and what to the bone. Yeah, they're kind of weird. Anyway, what was that about treasure? Little girls have no business knowing that. Then have fun with that jar of yours.
dealt with that owl. We're leaving. going. You thought that our final lesson. Keep up the good work. What's the use? I still didn't manage to get out. Let's play a game. Who can find the exit the fastest? I'm so sick of your games. Why didn't you find the exit before? Well, I had nobody to play with. <laughs>
bomb you made. I'm impressed. Instead of spying on me, why don't you find an exit? I don't feel like living anymore. Watching you is interesting. <laughs>
seen something like that.
You're naughty, girl! You got out after all! Well, how the crown? Not too tight? Well, I don't need it. You want it? We'll settle up later. Sure! I always dreamed of being in charge. There be no ruling for me. The crown is as ghostly as the whole world of owls. No crown means no help. Just try believing Molik after that. Tell me, did you look out for the other kitties or just yourself? I saved them. It's part of the game, right? Hmm, really? That's unexpected. Well, what are you waiting for? You think that mass adoration is going to last forever? Look, some of them are starting to suspect something. <gasps> Time to run! <laughs> used to it. another way. Do you 
think you're going? Away from here. Maybe there's a way through the castle? <clears throat> that could be. But there is no getting into the castle. Let's work together. Tell me what to do and where to go. My head hurts too much to focus.
useless and she won't let her scene before midnight anyway there's not much time left now we can wait it out relax old timer no girl time doesn't pass by itself here Ah! <laughs> 
Such lovely kids I spy these days. I'm just sure to have a ball. And they come for checkups every morn. Now, now, there's no use in struggling, child. Open up now, nice and wide. Let me treat your pearly whites. <gasps> Why so angry, little one? Do you know not of sugar plums? Did your mother not feel your tongue? If she won't feed you, then I must. Let me fix this and stuff your mouth full of sugar by my own design. You lick your fingers, no more tears. Now, those pearls shall be no more. Your mouth will cramp from awful pain, and your gums will bleed. And until come to snatch your teeth, one, two, and good as new. <laughs> Stay 
here a while. And I'll bake you some fluffy bread. You won't need teeth. Your gums will do just fine. <laughs> Sorry, if I save you, Auntie won't fix my teeth. Wait! Don't leave me here! Backstabber. Fine, I'll get out by myself. to be scared of going to the dentist. Sly child, it's hide and seek we're playing, eh? My count is up, so I'm on my way. Keep in mind, I know every nook and cranny. this bed over, but I don't want to get my hands dirty. This is madness! No, I'm not gonna be a guinea pig.
like a lockpick. It's worth a try. This damn block! Nothing works! to see you and your teeth. They seem to be in place for now. So where's Auntie? As long as she's not here, I don't care. You want some honey? Or a lollipop? Suck your own lollipops. I've got to get out of here. <laughs> Queen, so sweet that my jaw is cramping. Just the thing to send teeth packing. I'll dash and fetch my hat smacking ladle. Shush, quiet. What if I know where our runaway is right now? Tell me, and I'll get you a jar from the stash. She tired herself a running and took a nap on your feather bed. 
the cheek of her. Hey, Whistle! Run away before it's too late. Why did you help me? We are playing, remember? So I'm glad to have an occasion. There's the hidden exit here. Find it. What's got you down? I can't find any BB teeth. Ah, so that's what was stuck between my teeth. Oh, Auntie, she's already putting it in honey. teeth left. your bare hands.
I'm too tired to keep searching. I'll have to pull out my own.
Don't you like this place? Hold on, let me get my head straight first. Sure, you'll get a whole eternity. <sighs> so, where are we? In a cemetery. Bear in mind that even the locals are afraid of this place. <sighs> Nothing can scare me after Auntie's house. It's that so, huh? Remember, <laughs> we're still playing. You're it. I'm sick of all this. I want to go home. What a want flow under the tombstone by itself. If a task is once begun, never leave it till it's done. Quit quoting proverbs at me. It's super irritating. <laughs> Did you meet the girl, my sweet? I saw her. She fell right over the caretaker's shower as she was running off. Oh, really? I or to it did the girl stumble straight into a coffin. That's that. Hell's bells, pray tell! It was the shovel or the coffin? I am telling you, evil spirits dragged her into the coffin, and the caretaker gave her a whack on the head with his shovel for good measure. My dear, are you making things up or telling the truth? Me? I'm making things up, of course. I'm always spinning yarns. That's just the way I am. Have you seen the child or not? What child? There are plenty of them around here. Alas, I see. From you, there'll be no answer. <laughs> Another ghost. Give your glasses a wipe. I'm no ghost. That's not possible. How did a live human get here? From the world of the living. Could have thought it, right? It's true. You're no mirage. And who are you? I'm a cabinet maker. 
You make coffins? They forced me. They've been keeping me on a leash for an eternity. Got it. Well, I'm off. Wait, girl. You can help me by looking for the keys to my shackles. And what's in that for me? I can give you a reward. While I was still upstairs, I learned how to breathe life into trees and create idols to help me. It was tough. I had to go to an enchanted lake. It's much easier to do that here. There is dead water everywhere. An interesting story. Tell me more sometime. What was that you were saying about idols? They are fail-safe and can do literally everything. Give me one and we'll see what it can do. Here, take my best idol. He'll serve you well. Come here. Don't be scared. Are you sure he's the best? He doesn't look like much. I am ready to serve my new mistress. <laughs> How cute! I'll try to help you, but I can't promise anything. I'll wait and keep my fingers crossed. Don't touch that tool. I need it. Oh, what use are you? You're just an extra weight, that's all. I'm tired. I am a special. I am Oak. My Linden brothers are lighter, but there's less useful. How old are you, kiddo? Huh, what's an old? I've made myself super useful. I saw 300 wooden boards for coffins. Do you want me to set you free? That's not an option, madam. I must serve. I was made to make people happy. You were made to make me happy. Oh, what use are you? I am a spe- <coughs> Keep your wits about you, girl. The caretaker doesn't like strangers.
beautifully beautiful side. treasure.
Girl, help me. I'm over here, by the tombstone. What do you need? I escaped from captivity, and now I want to go home to my mom. He wants his money. Remember how rude you were to her. Well, we do. Yes, I was an awful son and friend, but I realize that now, and I want to go back home. Help me. I know you're getting out of here. Bring me with you. It's up to you. to read what it says? What's that you've got there? I'm starting to understand these symbols. Mm. It's describing a ritual from the Book of the Dead that can transfer mm. a body from a cemetery to the neighboring island. It does mean a dead body, mm. but that's probably no biggie. Are you sure? No, but it's a chance to escape. It's hardly the best chance. I don't feel like dying. You're in hell. Death isn't the worst thing that could happen to you. That sounds less than comforting. So what do I need for this ritual? You'll need dead water and any valuable item. But where can I get all of that? Cheer up! You're in the realm of the dead. You can dig up anything if you search hard enough. Swimming in the sea of dreams, and now I'm lost adrift. Now I'm from the empty, worst expense to this wretched song and dance. Who oh, pray tell is to play? Very nice, and in verse too. Something seems to be upsetting you, am I right? <sighs> I'm missing a soul, one from the sake zone, not my own. Bring it back to me, so I can lock her up and throw away the key. Perhaps I can help you? <sighs> help me? You're so uh, just fine. I actually had something else in mind. Help finding the missing soul, but not for free. <laughs> I like people who know what they want, and I'm very keen on haggling. Get me the soul, and you'll get a reward. You're no stranger, I see, to bartering. 
decided yet. Touch my flint. What if I want to smoke for a stint? Give it her, I need it to light up, my dear. the treasures aside from souls, you know? Any of my wares could be yours in an instant. If you come back with something precious in town. you got there? It's the cemetery's old accounts book. That's odd. What's the sun doing on the cover? <laughs> That's nothing of note here. Just a load of names and numbers. One date is written in blood. The year one five two four. Mm. Ew. Ah, exchange it back. <laughs> 
I'll put it in my sack. After all, you're not the worst of lasses, and you'll come in handy when time passes. <laughs> This key doesn't fit. Where did it come from? From the yard. I had to do some tinkering to get it. It's a nice looking key and all, but it won't do.
an enormous key. It's clearly not for my shackles, though. some goodness in your heart. Don't lose it.
a carpentry till no more. A sample item, but it's handy for sure. And the engraving is a talisman who worked with it for a long spell. the flint, but don't waste your time, and bring it back without delay. Yeah, hear what I say? Yep, clear as day, thanks. for some kind of ritual. Nothing. Hmm. I probably need to burn something special. No getting around this without sacrifices. But I tried. Sorry, little one, but you need to serve a great purpose. I'm so happy that I could help. It's what I always dreamed of. Sorry, but I don't make the rules around here.
I felt the heat from there. So you burned the crypt to the ground, my dear. and wear the necklace during the ritual. While you were away, I found a suitable place for the ritual and got everything prepared. See that crypt with the gargoyles at the entrance? Meet me there. decided yet. <laughs> oh, Ingrid! Finally! I'm ready. Start the ritual. Let's do this! There's just one thing you should know, but I don't think it'll faze you. You see that coffin? It's for you. Ah! It'll serve as a teleporter. You scared? As if. Let's do this. I hope I didn't get anything mixed up. <laughs> from your little world. I was checking how the weather is over there. It's pretty warm. I guess now would be a good time to go back. I must admit, you really surprised me. Oh yeah? How? Just take a look at your hands. Oh. How did you good? And you're atoned for your sins. The game is over. Now you can go through the waterfall without any issues. Really? Have I ever lied to you? Maybe you haven't lied exactly, but you're always leaving things out. Anyhow, you are smart enough to get your hands on everything for the ritual. I thought I'd go mad. But you didn't. And I'm pleased to see that. Thanks for your help, Malik. I wouldn't have managed alone. Alrighty then. I'm off. It's lunchtime. 